Hi everyone, Hugo releases an updated version or two versions of his extra gear. He now provided an 3-in-1 or a 5-in-1 multi-wine extra gear. So let's check what's new. In multi-wine you can get from wine 3.05 to wine 7 and in wine 3.1 you can add wine 4 to wine 6 and on the right side it's the my Poco F4 with 8 Gen 1 in my previous video um, I showed that the shortcuts didn't work but um, I'll show you the workaround here at first so if you open shortcut it won't launch and to fix this you can just I edited this shortcut already so you can uh, remove some command line to get it working so that's the full screen OpenGL 3.3 and the thing here is you just remove the um, task set 0 to 3. So save it and then it should it should work. So full screen open shell 3.3 and boom you see it's working so if someone got this problem too just remove it in my poco f3 there's no problem at all you can just run it as presetted and it's working okay so what's new about this version so the dark team is all already um, known in previous versions, but um, he added to um, the display option here so you can change it by yourself or edit it something. It's cool, it's, it's like feeling in, to have an old PC, <laughs> 256 uh, colors, and um, he has added new MISA versions. It's here the 22 version, um, version 3 by Hugo. Um, I need more, some more testing. I don't know uh, what's fixed or what's better. I think there are some graphic issues fixed and some new Wine D3D 7.18 and 7.21. The rest I think there's some new GPU names you can use it and the rest is like before service manager what's that okay or someone who knows what it is can use it And the rest is it's really the same so let's check it if it runs mm. let's start an easy game since it's HN1 only virtual overlay works so limbo should work I don't know which wine version I used now it's 3.05 I tested um, more games on my Poker 3 and I can say that uh, Wine 7 is great because of more compatibility and I think of Wine 7, Wine D3D 7 to 721 
boost up some FPS and fix some craft issues I will show later. Oh, the game is easy. It should work. Yes. Okay, I'm tired. Okay. So, you can see also where the gel overlay is very compact. I like it. It's um, it's all what you need. You know already what it what it does, and you can just clean and start services, and that's it. So let's switch up to Poco F3 and see what uh, performance you can expect on. Snapdragon 870. So you know, I uploaded previously Prince of Persia of Accord and Sands. It had um, 25 to 30 FPS, but with, um, however, with Wine D3D 21, you can get up up to 40 fps so it it's really increased still crash and um, freeze are um, not fixed but it's because of um, because of extra gear by itself so i am let's switch to turn up again okay So this game runs with the resolution, medium settings, okay. I really like dark mode because I really I am mostly testing at night. Okay. And in Wine 7, um, I noticed that the sound error, which was in Wine 3.5, is also fixed, so that's really nice. without input grips so okay, this scene is also 20 to 30 fps but in the opening scene where you previously get or, or got 30 fps it's up to 5 fps higher so okay let's do this Okay, mm. this game need, needs to be installed in Drive C because this leg is really heavy. It's really annoying, but it's, it's fixable. Okay, let's start another game. Fallout New Vegas, but it's better to get <coughs> free course because you will get some FPS boost. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. It's a mix of low and mm, medium settings. Mostly low settings, but all effects are on. And with the original multi wine, I don't know, games didn't work for me, and it, it's really laggy in uh, Explore by itself. But with Hugo, it's really better. And the OBV file is really, really small. It's just only 580 megabytes. So it's really compact for those with uh, low storage. It's really nice, nice addition. So I'm excited to see other testers using that too, to see if there's really some improvements in other games. And as I said, in some games I got an FPS boost with the new um, Wine D3D. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 still works the same, even with the newest Mesa. Um, but it's nice to have a new version, maybe some uh, Graphical issues are fixed. So let's see, it's loading, it's still loading. But it should be almost done. or not but it did work earlier let's still wait again okay This area, 20 FPS. Hmm. Maybe I should have to restart the container, but that's how it now runs. What is still not working is, I hope it's um, someone fixed it someday, is uh, Call of Duty is still not working in turnip mode, it still crashes um, before it loads into the game.
Ah, I, I, I see what I, I'm done wrong. It's CSMT to zero because it got to the menu. So let's check. And boom, it crashed here. Sometimes the video playback works at the loading screen, but then if the map is loaded, it still crashes. Okay, it's CSMT0 because Call of Duty is, is zero. So let's check it to three again. And follow should work faster with that. And boom, it crashed already here. So Call of Duty is not really working with that. Matrix, that company. So that's already it. It's really familiar what you can use there, but now with Multiwine and up to Wine 7, it's a nice addition. Thank you to Hugo and Mishka to release that version. So, see ya.